with him too. He was talking about how he was trying to wrestle with you and also kind of let you do your thing. And how has he kind of balanced coaching versus like being on the mat with you? Uh, he he's done a really good job of it. Uh, you know he's full time coaching and getting prepared for world championships at the same time. He's got a got a lot of stuff going on. Um, I think he's done a really good job of it. What what areas do you feel you've grown in the most working with him? Areas I've grown in the most, um, definitely gotten a lot better uh, at wrestling, obviously, <laughs> and then uh, you know, kind of living better lifestyle and just kind of staying focused on my goals uh, in the room and outside the room. Has just being on the mat with him brought out something different in you? You think? Competitively? Yeah, yeah, for sure. I've been. Uh, blessed throughout my career with a lot of great coaches with a lot of different backgrounds and I think uh, Coach Taylor's obviously a phenomenal wrestler and has a lot different background than um, what I've been coached by in the past and so I think uh, him being as great a wrestler he is is awesome and then also the the different perspective um, has been great. Knowing what was coming up for him when you were training with him is there, is there pressure that's involved in that for you on your side? As far as? Just knowing that you're trying to help a guy prepare for the world championships? Um, uh, yeah, uh, uh, no, <laughs> I'll be honest, no. I just uh, try to do what I'm told and, um, you know, any any way I can help him, I, I definitely want to do that because he's helped me so much and will continue to do so throughout my career. So it's really, really cool get to get to see him train for world championships and kind of get to see his process and everything. And I think it's been a great experience. Does the, does the room feel totally different going to practice now? Does it feel mostly the same? Kind of what's what's it like, just the difference between last year and this year? Because so much has changed since then. Uh, it's it's still very similar. Um, you know, a lot, a lot of the same guys, we're all, we've all been around each other, know each other, and, you know, we, we all got the same goals. So, uh, you know, I think some of the drills and maybe, you know, nuances are different, but everyone's still striving for you know, their goals and our goals as a program. So it's, you know, another year. When we were talking to Coach earlier, he was saying you kind of had a unique perspective because you were training him. And when you're training somebody, you know, your focus isn't on your next season. It's kind of getting somebody else ready for their thing. What was your approach? Because you still have, you know, your senior season you're getting ready for in both simultaneously training in, getting him ready for the World Team Trials, and then also getting ready for your season. Yeah, I think there's a lot of value. I mean, for one, I was getting to wrestle with Coach Taylor quite a bit, which is never a bad thing. Um, and for me, anytime I can help someone out, I, I want to be in a position to do that. And, uh, you know, like I said, he's he's given me so much and will continue to give me a lot. So to be in a position where I can actually give something back is uh, really cool. And, you know, I think perspective of it I mean, I'm helping him, but at the same time, I, I was getting a lot out of it. Um, still am getting a lot out of it, so it's not a not a one-way street. What's he like 